see hand. I need to wash my hand first. This edge is mm -hmm. so moist, so moist and fluffy. Hello bakers, you're welcome to Essential Kitchen. In today's class, I'm going to teach you how to make rich coconut cake and rich chocolate cake. So, yeah, so stay tuned. I'll begin by shredding the coconut. I'll shred the coconut and also get my coconut milk from here. So I'm going to do it by myself. I'm not buying from market. I'm not buying anything from market. So I'm going to do it with this. So it's going to be a lot of work, but I bet you you'll enjoy it. So first of all, I'll start by removing the coconut juice. So I'll just is this and open it from bottom here Extracted our coconut juice. I'm not using this thing. i and eat it. The next thing is to remove it from the shell. Remove the back. Nana, I want to say hi. Come and say hi to my friends. To remove this, I know remind my own, but I can do it. To remove the back, not be here, but I can do it. For the coconut juice, 
I'll use the tiniest one, this tiny one. Now I have gotten this. You can see this one is very tiny. So there's a difference. See this one. See this one. So I'm going to use this one and get my coconut milk. Coconut chaff is not a waste. You can use it to get your coconut flour. All you need to do is so some dry it, or you can use oven to dry it. Then you now grind it into fine powder. You grind it into fine powder, and that is your coconut flour. So this is the coconut milk. You can decide to drink it like this. It's very healthy. You can use it to make fried. You can use it to make chinese fried rice and coconut rice. So we use it for so many purposes. Now let's start proper. Cream your butter and sugar until it's light and fluffy. Our butter is one sachet, that is 250 grams, while the sugar is one cup. So we are going to cream it together. Cream it until light and fluffy. You just know that the more light and fluffy you cream your sugar and butter, the more moist and fluffy your, your cake becomes. Yes, that is the truth. So, cream it until it's pale, until it's very light. You will see the outcome. I will show you. We are done creaming our sugar and butter. So we are going to whisk the egg now. So I'm um, going to wash, I'm going to remove it. So let's whisk our egg. This is 10 eggs here. It's for both chocolates and uh, coconut cake. So after whisking it, I will separate it. 